after uh, the training, you can always uh, watch the recording. So guys, make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel and you always have the recording of this meeting, all right? This is our mass adoption meeting, a very special meeting that we usually have with the admin. And uh, today, guys, like I said, the admin will not be available, okay? And today we shall be doing our thing. And I always say it very important that since we have a lot of people coming into the community, it's always important for us to do a kind of rundown uh, in our website and discuss and discuss everything that is uh, important for us to discuss. So we shall have a kind of a one hour uh, training. Then we have questions and answers. I'm going to take all your questions, okay? I'll be taking all your questions. And Mr. Trust also will be working you um, uh, in the wallets, okay? And how to use the Merchant app. So how to use the application, sorry, how to use the application in our wallets. Mr. Trust will be working you through just after my presentation so that some of you can actually know how to use the app. The app is so awesome. Uh, they'll be teaching you how to scan and do payment, all right? So remember that we are on the street right now doing a lot of uh, merchant campaign, educating the people about TBC. So feel free to always come to me and ask any question that concerns merchant adoption. Okay, guys? All right, so that being said, uh, like I said, uh, please, please um, just, if you have a question, just hold on, okay? If you, if you have a question, just hold on. Uh, we'll take your question after the, after my brief presentation. So just give me like 45 minutes and uh, listen carefully. If you're just coming in for the very first time, control your mic and just uh, have your seat, get some water, get some tea, coffee, and uh, listen to what I'm about to share with you because it is going to help you and uh, bring in more people in the community. All right, guys, let me quickly share my screen with you, all right? Um, and I'll be going to the Kringle Cash. And by the way, guys, the keyword of the day is Kringle, all right? The keyword of the day is, uh, the keyword of the day is Kringle. Kringle is the keyword of the day, all right? So guys, the keyword of the day is Kringle, all in small letters. Kringle is the keyword of the day, okay, guys? So uh, that is the keyword of the day, okay? So um, instead, the keyword of the day. So Guys, let me share my screen. Uh, as we all know, this is our Kringle Cash website. The first icon here, you're going to see the COVID-19. We have very, very interesting and eye-opening videos here trying to expose how the COVID-19 thing is a scam. So you need to read or click and read some of the uh, um, videos, watch some of the videos that you have here, guys. So. These videos are all eye-opening, okay? So, and then write down, you have documents to prove to us, okay? Right now, you have documents. Try to follow this document. It got lots and lots of video links that can help you understand, okay? And uh, you have the login, you have the login. Or, uh, after the login, you have now the, our Goodwill. Uh, we are also a Goodwill community. We are also a Goodwill community, and we are actually, we are actually um, doing goodwill to uh, every living being on earth because that is who we are. We are a goodwill community and uh, we live to love one another with love and respect. There is something I want to, to tell you today, guys. Most of, most of, most of the time we have been um, passing this, um, some of you might not even know the explanation of this Kringle Society. Some of you might not even know the explanation of this, uh, uh, this logo. When you look at this logo here, it's not actually a logo. It's not actually a logo. It's actually uh, like a, how do I call it? Um, like a trademark, I don't know. But you have no authorization to use this unless by the general overseer of this society. Which is and um, uh, guys, now when you look at this, okay, when you click on goodwill, this symbolizes uh let me take uh, like one after the other this uh, symbolizes all the living being on earth that uh the living being on on the planets that uh, uh, uh blood flows through them okay this symbolizes all the living thing on earth and here you have amore e reverare means a latin word of love and respect 
okay? That's the Latin word of love and respect. And uh, guys, here you see hands holding hands. We don't care uh, what color you are, but you can see hands holding hands around the uh, planet because we are a good will. We are a good will and we deal with human beings around the globe. We don't care which country you are. We don't care what color you are. We don't care um, uh, where you are coming from, okay? So we, hands holding hands, all empowering. We are empowering people globally. That's why you see this, okay? And then you have the dolphins. The dolphins is our spiritual animal or our spirit animal. Or the dolphins is that animal that is so lovely, is so generous, is so kind. Uh, you read more about the dolphins. The dolphin is a very lovely animal. So that is why we are using it as our spirit animal, okay? We prefer the dolphins. It's a very good animal, um, so lovely, um, save lives, so kind. You, you might want to, it's so playful. It's a very adorable animal. So that's why we are using it here, okay? Then um, you now have, here shows abundance. Here is all about abundance. The, all in, on earth, there is a lot of abundance on earth and we need to enjoy that abundance. That's why you see, you see the sky here, there's no limitation. If there's no limitation. Then you have uh, these fruits. There is no uh, bearing fruit. We are bearing fruit of abundance. We are sowing seeds of abundance, bearing lots and lots of fruits. Okay, we are sowing seeds of abundance, bearing lots and lots of fruits. So uh, it's all about abundance. So guys, this is the signification or this is uh, what this stands for. And you have no right to use this unless authorized by our general overseer. So that's the meaning of this, guys. If you have been saying this all the time and you don't know what it means, that is the full explanation of that, okay? And um, we have two goodwill ambassadors, Mr. Stephen Coffey and I, all right? We are a goodwill ambassadors. And we have a lot of people uh, coming up. They shall be like junior ambassadors very soon. And of course, guys, these are some of the things that we are doing. We are doing goodwill. We are doing goodwill. This is our last goodwill program. You might want to come to this and read some of the things that we have been doing so far, okay? You might want to come and read some of the things that we have been doing so far. So, guys, um, we have been doing a lot of goodwill all over. The last one was in Nigeria, guys. So, come to us, come to the website, and uh, make sure that you go through some of this goodwill uh, program that we did, all right? <clears throat> okay, guys, so that being said, if you also, um, if we go back to the website, if you go back to the website, um, let's go back here. After Goodwill, what do we have? Um, after Goodwill, we have uh, Merchant Location. Okay, we have Merchant Location. Okay, let's click on our Merchant Location. So, guys, our Merchant Location is growing like crazy. Our Merchant Location is growing like crazy. So. Um, let's quickly click on Merchant Location and see what we got there. <clears throat> I don't know, my internet is kind of um, slow. I don't know what is happening here, but okay. <clears throat> so once you want to know, some people are asking, where can I spend my TBC? Why, where can you spend your TBC? Click on Merchant Location, okay? Get, pick up a city or a town or a country, okay? Pick up a city or a town or a country. Uh, for example, if I pick up a city where I live, and I just go to uh, search, I just click on search here. I will be seeing all the merchants in this city. So if I click on search here, I'll be seeing, I'll be seeing all the merchants in this city where I live, okay? All right, guys, stop drawing on my screen. Stop drawing on my screen, okay? <clears throat> all right, so um, this, is, this is some of the areas where it's actually loading right now, okay, it's still loading. So these are some of the areas where you can actually spend some of your TBC if you're in my country, if you're in my right? It's a lot of areas, the major location, uh, you see some areas where you can actually spend your CBC coin. So guys, make sure that you come here, always come to the merchant zone, always come to the merchant zone and uh, it's still loading, it's kind of loading guys, so no problem. So when you go to merchant location, you see some of the areas that you can spend. All right? Some people uh, need to mute everyone. Please make sure that you remain muted, okay? Make sure that you stay muted, please. Thank you. 
All right, so um, let me keep sharing. Okay, let me keep sharing. <clears throat> okay, so guys, um, I was just showing you the major locations, some of the areas that you can actually spend your TBC. All these are major locations. In my country, we have even hotels accepting up to 30% in TBC. You can go there and you pay 30% in TBC. All right, so guys, some of you are asking where can I spend my TBC? These are the areas where you can you can spend your TBC. Come here and uh, get those areas. And uh, guys, you can also let's go to uh, public notice. Public notice is actually explaining our um, is explaining our article of association, our mission. All right, showing our mission. And you can go through the article of association. They, it is explaining who we are, all right? It's explaining who we are, what we are, what we are doing. So those are the article of association. You can go through that and um, enjoy, all right? So guys. So please, Mr. Trust, please keep an eye on those that are actually disturbing, all right? Guys, we might just kick you out if we keep getting you muted and you are not uh, controlling your mic. We might just kick you out of the training, okay? Make sure that you check your mic and let your mic be all muted, all right? Okay. <clears throat> so the article of association, you have, uh, you have our public notice, article of association, mission statement, rate, sect, rates. So guys, make sure that you come here and you read all these articles. These are articles showing who we are, what we are, and uh, what we are doing so make sure you always come and go through all of all of those okay yeah then uh, after this we can now go uh, log into our accounts okay we can now log into our accounts let me go to but now uh, we can now log in let me let me let me log in to our kringle cash now when we log into our kringle cash <coughs> Um, it's loading, network not very friendly. So just the patient for it to load. I think what I'm sharing is making it a little bit harder. Let me stop sharing, okay. Let me stop sharing so that I can load very fast. Okay, now I can share. <clears throat> so um, if we go to our Kringle Cash back office, if we go to our Kringle Cash back office, guys, um, we have the dashboard. Then we have our super promo. We have our super promo going on right now. This super promo permits you to um, uh, earn up to 100 coins if you pay your 8 grains of gold. Pay your 8 grains of gold. And make sure that you read... Oh, my God. A lot of background noise. I don't know why. Yeah, Michael? Removing him. Michael, make sure... Michael, stay muted, please. Okay, so um, make sure you control your mic. So you, when you go to the back office, please try to read this. Try to read this. It's very important. Usually when you're coming for the very first time, try to read this. Okay? It's very, 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 very important. And um, you now come to meetings. We have the mass adoption training. That is taking place every day, all right? We have a mass adoption training that is taking place every day when it is uh, Monday to Friday, when it's 8 a.m. West African time. You just click here. At 8 a.m., you are going to have the link, okay? And when you watch this meeting, you also get paid. You get paid for watching this meeting. So guys, come to this meeting, take the keyword and get paid. Today, the keyword is Kringle, okay? Keyword of the day is Kringle. So once you watch the meeting, once you have the keyword, what do you do? You just come here and you click on and you put the keyword of the day, which is, for example, Kringle. Okay, put a keyword of the day, which is Kringle, and you just submit the keyword of the day, Kringle. Right? When you submit the keywords, you submit the keyword. They'll tell you your keyword has been successfully submitted. My network is not very friendly. I don't know what's happening. Wow, okay guys, so that's a keyword. The keyword of the day is Kringle. So when you submit, they will tell you that, yeah, uh, they will tell you that you are um, 
keyword has been submitted, all right? So we have other meetings. You have the English meeting, you have the French meeting. This one takes place every Mondays when it's 5 p.m. West African time. So you have all this taking place there, okay? So you can always watch, uh, get the keyword there and submit, and you earn some Kringles. Then you have uh, the rewards. You're going to see a reward. You click on this reward, and you will be able to see all your rewards, okay? Then uh, we also have marketing. We have two links. You're going to sign up somebody. You have two links, okay? We have two links. When you click here, you have your referral link and the merchant link, okay? You have the referral link, the merchant link. If you want to sign up a merchant, you can click, uh, let's say, uh, you want to sign up a merchant. Wow. The internet is really, really, really crazy. I don't know what is happening. All right, guys, just hold on. Just hold on for a second. One second. Yes, just refresh and go back. All right, guys, just hold on for one second. Let me, uh, let me see uh, if I can switch connection here. Um, it's really crazy what is happening here. I think uh, the MTM network of a thing is actually a very, very, a very, very big problem. I'm still trying to disturb us. So just be patient while I try to get switched to another network very quick here. Um, it's working now, Ambassador. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Just make just one second. Oops. Well. All right, let me see what is happening here. Just like this. It's not working for me. <laughs> Not, not working for me so far. Okay. All right. Just trying to switch, but okay, it's back now. Kringle Cash is back now, guys. Let me share my screen again. Okay, so we have um we have our Kringle Cash, all right? So you can actually, you have two links. This is when you want to sign up uh, somebody who is not a merchant. If you want to sign up a merchant, use this link, okay? This is a merchant listing. And uh, when we go back to uh, marketing, we have brochures, bring those brochures, get the merchants on board. You want to see your referrals, the number of people you have signed up, you have your business card, you can print it. You have your referrals, you want to see the number of referrals that you have. And also, you have um, uh, your merchant referrals. Guys, um, my merchant referrals, we are actually out there trying to bring in lots and lots of merchants, okay? Actually out there trying to bring in lots. Oh my God, it's crazy what is happening here, I don't know. So, I don't know what is happening with my network here. Can you choose to vote that for? Let me, we don't have, I don't use Vodafone here. Vodafone is not in my country again. They left. Yeah, don't worry. Okay. Let's see what is happening. Okay. Well, now we, here we are. Okay. Here we are. All right. So I'm trying to show you the number of merchants that I already got so far. Uh, we are doing serious merchant campaign right now. Like, Every day, my team and I, we are out there trying to get more merchants on board, okay? So guys, um, so far we have 1,000, okay? So far we have 1,232 merchants. My, my objective for this month is to have 1,500 merchants. I just pray I should have. I have just two days to go. I have just two days to go, so 
I hope that uh, I'm going to reach my objective, right? I hope I'll be able to reach my objective, but I have just two days to go. So guys, meaning that when I pay my back office this month, okay, when I pay my back office this month, I'm going to have um, 1,232 TBC, assuming that I do not add any other merchant. But if I add merchant and I have 1,500 here, when I pay my back office fee, I'll have extra 1,500 coins plus another extra 100 coins for the super promo. So each merchant that you bring on board gives you one TBC coin. Each merchant that you register will give you one TBC coin, all right? So that's gonna be awesome. I need a lot of this coin. I just need it like crazy. Okay, guys, uh, we have a merchant listing that we have seen. We have the T-shirt committee. The T-shirt committee, you can actually take uh, loans and uh, you bring a T-shirt, you sell, okay? You sell and give back the loan. The T-shirt must carry a message that says, I do not consent to tyranny. So you sell the t-shirt to raise capital and you refund the money. We have the committee, you can get to them. We have the genealogy tree, we have the posters, membership charts, invitations. So guys, these are just, uh, uh, you want to see your downlines, you have posters you can use, membership chart, you want to see the graphs, you want to invite somebody, that is it. You can just click there, all right? Then you have the education part of it, guys. You have the TBC websites we have the current price chart ultimate price charts we have the currency calculator some of you do not even know the value of one tbc today we have the currency calculator here once you click on currency calculator it automatically takes you where to um where, where to it actually takes you where you can find the calculate the value of one tbc coin okay it takes you where you can calculate the value of one tbc coin for example if the value of one just put one there and uh, you select USD. The value of one CBC coin is over $13 million today, all right? The value of one CBC coin is over 13 million USD. Wow, this is awesome, very, very awesome. And then uh, guys, uh, we have the ultimate or the CBC uh, maximum value. So when CBC arrived at maturity, oh my God, just seeing this. When CBC will reach maturity, Okay, when TBC reach maturity, um, uh, my network is crazy. Just hate this. <sighs> okay, let me stop sharing and see what is happening here. Yeah. I hope everybody can. Can, you, can your host help you share? Yeah, uh, hold on one second. Let me see what is happening here, please. Okay. Um, okay. All right. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, I don't know. It's very difficult for me to get what I want. <laughs> yes, refresh your page. It will come. Thank you. Looks like uh, this page was disturbing. I still don't know what is happening. Okay. Okay, here we are. All right. So, um, the value of TBC at maximum, um, when we shall reach maturity, we shall have the aspect today. Oops, aspect today value. Let's assume that we reach maturity. <clears throat> the value of one TBC at maximum will be 3 billion or 3.8 billion dollars. Woo! So if you have 100 TBC today, when we arrive maturity, you are going to be automatically a billionaire. All right? And then we have our education. We have the public, what is for the public, and then we have what is for the private. So you can always go through our educational parts. The private, you must be a member before you can get our private information. You must be a, a member. And uh, yeah, we are private, we are not sacred, okay? We are private, we are not sacred. So you can want to have access to our private information, always get to the blog. Then you can read what is here, some videos, private society. Please stop drawing on my screen. Stop drawing on my screen. Then we have contests. We have contests. We have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six contests, five where you can earn Bitcoin bounties. You can earn Bitcoin for the contest, all right? And uh, if you have the highest number of referrals or that renew 
their account for that week, okay? You have the highest number of people that renew their account for that week, then you will be paid. If you are the first position, you pay 200 grains of gold, about 800 and something USD. If you are the second position, you earn uh, 100 grains. If you are third, about, uh, sorry, if you are second, you earn 100. If you are third, you earn about 50 grains of gold, which ranges from about $800, $400, and $200. If you, are the, if you are the highest position so far, all right? So you can participate in this and earn a lot of money from here. And then we have the heavy heater bonus. If you sign up to a thousand members and the admin will pay you 30% extra for the uh, people that, uh, uh, admin will pay you 30% extra for the people that pay for the admin fee for that month, okay? So that is how you can earn from this contest. And uh, we have the UR, we have, uh, your accounts you can walk walk through here you can buy bulk payment to renew people's accounts uh, you can approve registration when people pay with uh, bulk credit and uh, you can have payment history change sponsor cash center you can become a cash center you if you are a merchant or if you're a member you want to become a merchant you need to click here and fill this form if you are a member and then now you want to become a merchant log into your account Still click here to fill the merchant listing registration. Okay, then uh, we also have Bitcoin bounces. Bitcoin bounces enable you to earn 50%, enable you to earn 50% of uh, any person that sign up with your link and pay the admin fee. If the admin fee is eight grains of gold, you have four grains of gold that comes to you automatically that you can catch it out or you can uh, collect. Okay, so uh, any person that pay his admin fee, you earn 50% in Bitcoin. That is a straight commission job. This is not a network marketing, okay? Then you also have the help decks. You have the chat. The help decks permit you to contact um, support. If you have a problem, technical problem, you can contact support. And we also have member helpers. Member helpers, uh, we have Move for Money, uh, which is one of our mo uh, members helper. We have Ivy, we have Mizano, we have Christina. There are just many of them that are yeah. member help us, you can also contact them to get your problems solved, technical problems solved very, very fast. And then you have the chat. The chat permits you to communicate, okay? The chat permits you to communicate with your downlines. And admin says that the chat will be developed more and it's going to be prettier than what you have today. Okay, guys, so I'm just trying to walk you through the website and then we can now discuss our questions and answers. The key word of the day is Kringle. All right, so let's discuss some questions and answer, and then we shall come to Mr. Trust, who will take us into the app, okay, in the app that we have in our uh, Kringle Cash. Madam Hudaya is the first speaker. Let's hear from her. You have a question or you want to contribute? Yeah, just uh, contribute, please, uh, um, Ambassador Mbe. Always a pleasure when you're training. Always a pleasure. So much uh, knowledge. Um, I would just like to find out, could you please find out who keeps scribbling on the screen when admin is presenting and yourself? I find it extremely irritating, disrespectful. It really annoys me. And I'm sorry, I, I'm taking up time to, to uh, put this out there. This person need to be, you know, just kick him out or her. It's very disrespectful. That's true. That's true. We are still trying to uh, get the person, but uh, middle will get that person to be kicked out. Just uh, sometimes sharing and trying to get somebody who is sharing the screen, who is uh, disturbing is um, not really easy. But uh, we'll get Maybe no way. Hello. No, 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 just one moment, please. Thank you very much, um, uh, Ambassador Embe because I know members of my team here has really benefited from your presentation just now. Thank you. Okay, welcome. that's you're it, welcome. thank you. You're, you're welcome. Uh, Can I say something to that, please? Patience, go ahead. Uh, go ahead, Patience. Yes, please. Um, let's hear yes, from Patience. Thank you, good morning. Good morning. Sometime, yes, it is good morning. Good morning. The scribbling on the screen sometimes is not intentional. There was a time I did it, but I there is a pencil-like um, icon 
on the screen. So if somebody touches it intentionally, it will scribble on the screen. So when I saw it happen to me, I, I now got aware of that particular icon. It's blue. It's in a, it's in a circle and bluish. So if everybody will take note of that, so that when they are holding their handsets, they don't touch that particular icon. It's, it's meant for writing. But a lot of people do not know. So when they touch it mistakenly, those scribblings, scribblings appear on the screen. That's all I have to say. Thank you. OK. Thank yes, you. please. Um, I bought um, a book credit for two people on Wednesday. But as of now, it's still not in. I don't know. Oh. Yes. Um, uh, is that Dominic? Yes, please. Yes, um, um, actually, the problem is the blockchain you are using uh, not confirming very fast. So no, your contact no, it, it has confirmed like long time. Yes, you are going to contact uh, Move for Money. Uh, they just post the link here to uh, the meeting after this meeting. So you're going to contact them, and they're going to help you. Okay. They are going to help you. That's the link that has just been posted. You can join them on Facebook. If you have any worries, technical problem, they're going to help you on that. Okay, Dominic. Hello, sir. Hello, good morning. All right. Make sure you always sugar include, uh, show your hands up so that we can call you. Okay, Dorothy Amankwa. Wait. Uh, good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Yeah, please. I entered my keyword in my back office three days ago, but that's not that's reflected in my account. Did you click on the Kringle reward? Yes, sir. You must click on the Kringle reward for it to spin. All right. When it spins now, yeah, you are your Kringle will be reflected after some hours. That is. Mr. That is after after, after uh, entering the in the at the back office. Will I have something like a uh, Kringle? Just like what you said, I forgot it. Yeah, when, you just, when you have Where can when I find you, in your wallet, you okay. find in your okay, wallet. Okay, then so after entering the, after entering the keyword in the Kringle the cash, I will come to the TBC. That means that's where I'll get the Kringle reward. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. All right. Thank you. Okay, Mr. Trust, you want to say something? You know, I was just uh, trying to, for the purpose of the training, just maybe if you can share your screen and demonstrate, because some of the members here don't even know where to find the, the reward uh, button. Thank you. All right. Yeah. Uh, my network is funny this morning. I don't know. Kringle Cash is not really friendly. Okay. Thank so, you. I will share. It's taking time to load. Maybe they should be working or something. It's already taking a lot of time to load. I don't know why. Okay. We'll, we'll come back to that. Okay. We'll come back to that. Okay. So let's take another person. Um, who do we have? Uh, you have a question, guys. Please uh, make sure you indicate. I'm saying, um, Lock, uh, Luke Tombam, Prem J. I'm seeing your hands up. Luke Tombam. Uh, then we also have another one, Bill Zillion. Bill Zillion, unmute yourself, please. Yes, go ahead. Unmute yourself, Bill. At the time when you have, as it were, the peak of right, right. Bill, you're you're not saying anything. Can't hear you. <laughs> okay, bill one, bill two, bill and three. Let's go with uh, uh, Ajewami Bola. Unmute. unmute, unmute. You are talking, we can't hear you. You have to unmute. Good morning, Mr. Ambe. Are you hearing me? Yes, five on five. Okay, good morning, sir. Good morning. I really appreciate uh, this uh, community that I find myself. Uh, and I really want to follow after you. 
uh, I really thank God for being here. Please, concerning the enlisting uh, of uh, merchants, you discussed that you employ people that are working with you to register the merchants. I want to ask that those people, when if we employ people that will help us to go out to register the merchants, how do they uh, get the money for their uh, to, to pay their admin fee? That is to get people that are faithful. Is it possible to assign them, train them, and send them out to enlist the merchants and tell them to get the uh, reg their registration money? How does it work? Hello? Okay. <clears throat> yes, <clears throat> I can hear you. Um, now, um, you know, that is a training of its own, okay? Uh, that is a training of your own. I cannot uh, give you all the training here now, but uh, it's very simple. Um, it is simple, and at the same time, it's not simple. <laughs> okay, but, um, you know, one thing, if you want this special training, uh, it is important for you to uh, maybe show me the screenshot of... Uh, the amount that you have that you are ready to pay people because there's no need for us to talk about that when uh, members are just want to get a training just like that if if you want to take time for us to train on that show me your wallet that you are ready to employ people maybe you have some thousand dollar in your bitcoin wallet that you are ready to pay people i train you how to pay them how to uh, get them on board now the the, the the people that are going out they work under your link they sign up merchants. Like in my office, I have three groups of people. One group, they go out. Another group, uh, calling. Another group, follow up. That's the three group I have in my office, okay? And there is a process of employment. When you want somebody to work for you, there is a due process. I have a ready start company. So I don't just uh, call people, hey, come, come, come. Come and work for me. I'll pay you. Go out there and sign merchant. No, 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 no. There is a process for that to happen. Okay, so uh, I don't just um, um, tell people that come because sometimes when you tell people like that, they don't take you serious. We have a company, we have an office, we go, you go through interview, like placing your, C, your CVs, interview and selection and training. Then when we train, we take you now out. So it's a whole process. So we, are, we don't just uh, take it like a child's play. It's not a child's play. It's a very serious thing we do in the office. Very, very serious. And they have supervisors, they have people that have trained, I have my assistants uh, that have all trained and they take care of most of the work. Like now I'm here and the office is already operational right now. People are already in the office working. All right? Okay. Yeah, so it's a whole thing to do. It's a whole process to do. Okay, another okay. question on that. Thank you, no, thank you so much. You're welcome, let's hear from Lena. Lena, on mute. Okay. Good morning, Ambassador Mbe and all the division on the platform. Good morning. Mine is just the question and the clarity I would love to have. Um, the first one, when you were doing a lecturing, when you were, we were teaching us how to, to do different things on our back office, I came to realize on the merchant list under um, under contestant or status, it is written new member or not renewal. I would like to understand, is it the new member, if you bring the new member on that week, you will end up in the contestant? Or is it when you have to renew your people which is under you start paying or both? Now the second one, that is the, the first one. The second one is under um, contestant. The, the context. Uh, uh, yeah. The context, right? Mm -hmm. uh, how does it how does it oh, work? Okay. okay, I have to meet some people. All right. Okay, the contest, Please how does it work? Me. All right. Now, uh, how does it work? Okay. It's when you have the new referral, old referral, renew their back office, 
or is it when you have also the new member which is coming on board or both? When they because renew, once I understand that, it will help me to do my work. Yeah, it's, it's basically for renewers, okay? When somebody signed up for free and then he renew his account, that when it is, count, it, it is counted on the contest, okay? And how do you determine uh, for the person to go in a contestant? Do we need to inform you or you just get it? When you join as a member, you are, you, you are, mm. you are, being, uh, you are being placed on the English contest by default, you know? Mm -hmm. So you can decide to change. You go to your profile area, you select full timer, right. you watch mm -hmm. you watch the weekly meeting for the contest you want to uh, uh, participate. You insert the keyword, uh, you select full timers, you select the language. You select the language, okay? Then uh, next week, <laughs> next week you automatically be next week you automatically be in the contest, okay? So you can mm -hmm. select, you go to your profile, you select what contest you want to participate. It is on your profile area. I can't show you my profile area now because of security reasons, okay? Yeah. So um, you go to your profile and you select all that. So those that will renew their account for that week automatically place you on the contest of that week. If you have the highest number of referrals, you, you win, okay? So yeah. that, is how, that is how it works. Now for mm -hmm. the, the, the table, merchant listing, the renewer, mm -hmm. and uh, in fact, there you just, they are just showing you statistics for people that have paid, those that have not paid, those that are new, those that came in for free, those that have not renewed, it's just the statistics they are giving you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can, um, you, can, you, you can as well just find out those that have paid from there, just to help you see those who are paying and those who are not paying. <laughs> Uh, Ambassador. Yes. Um, uh, again, before we end, this is the end of the day because I have got, uh, I have a scheduled meeting for one person, for two persons during the weekend. I would love you to show me again a bit on a, on a merchant um, sign up. And also, if the person wants to, to have, for example, to become merchant, and also at the same time, they want to own the account as a Tibetan or a Pringle case back office. Will he need to require to sign both at the same time on a different? You only have one account. And uh, in TBC, we consider a living man and woman. Okay. Uh -huh. So once, well, if you sign up, let's say you sign up using um, uh -huh. the merchant or you did not use the merchant link, maybe use just your referral link. If you yeah, use yeah. this link to sign up, yeah. then you want to become mm -hmm. a merchant. What you need yeah. to do now is just to go to your account area and then you fill this form. You fill the merchant listing registration. That's what you need to do. Uh -huh. Even if you sign up using a merchant link and you want to, mm -hmm. you want to go mm -hmm. to, you want to become a merchant, mm -hmm. you must fill this form. Even if you sign up using a merchant mm -hmm. listing, after you finish the sign up process, you must come here and fill this form. Uh -huh. And you submit. Okay, you must fill this uh -huh. form and uh, you submit uh -huh. right here. Okay. Uh -huh. Now I got it. Right. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much, Ambassador. You're welcome. All right. All right. Let's hear from uh, Ima. Yes. Edu. Yes. Hello, Ambassador. Yeah. Is that trust? Yes, okay. Ambassador Mbe. Okay, I just wanted to intervene about uh, the lead, a leader, uh, Lina. I believe she's yes. from Namibia. Yes. Mm. Yes, I, I did. I did send you uh, my my personal WhatsApp number. Please just contact me. I can always because you are from Namibia. And I'm from Sosnien, uh, Zoom. I can train you about everything that you did want. You send Thank you. I just send you a, a, a WhatsApp. Yeah. Did you send private. me on private? Okay. Let me yes, let me yes. check. Okay, that's okay, fine. Yeah. That's Thank fine. you so much. I, I will Mr. send Madden. mine also. Perfect. No. Okay. okay. It's fine. Okay. Great. 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 All right. Um, yeah. From um, Emma. Emma now. Yeah. Hello. 
Yes. Hello. You have a lot of background noise, Emma. Yeah, I'm saying good morning. Good morning. Yeah, uh, good morning to all TV uh, Please, I have this question to ask. Uh, I paid my uh, I guess uh, admin fee, and I just wanted to ask whether if you pay your uh, admin fee, there's going to be a a a, a, a bit of a bounty for you. Uh, actually, my administrator paid it, my sponsor paid it for me, and I just wanted to ask whether. There will be a Bitcoin bounty for you, and also uh, the screens that you've been sharing. Uh, it's different. It's it's different from mine because when you when you share some screens on your on your, on your, on your uh, laptop or phones, when I check mine, there is different, and I don't know the reason why. So this is the question, and uh, my last question is that all exhibitions in Takwa here in Ghana, we are meeting this Sunday at the Blue Lodge. So please, those. On in Takwa on this platform, we are meeting this Sunday to discuss on uh, how to move this uh, 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 de 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 deprived company uh, forward. So thank you very much. Okay, thank you, um, Ima. When you pay your admin fee, okay, in order for you to benefit the Bitcoin bounty, somebody to pay uh, below you, okay. So okay. If I'm if you are my sponsor and I pay, you have fifty percent of that amount that you can collect. Uh, in, you can collect in Bitcoin. Yeah, I, I've 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 been waiting. My uh my my pastor, my sponsor, that's uh, Pastor Bednego paid my uh I guess a admin fee, but I've not received I've not received any Bitcoin bounty yet. How do you want to receive when uh, uh when have you really start have you signed up any person below you? Yes, yes. And the person paid? Yes, but the person hasn't paid the August one. But he paid for the uh, July. Yes, he has paid for the admin fee, the starting one. He has paid for everything. But you have not received bounty? Yeah, uh, for that one, I, I received it a long time ago. But I, yeah. I'm just asking whether uh, when you you pay it for the next month, you are going to receive another one or something else like that. No, when he pays, not when you pay. When he pays, you receive another one. Okay, you get it from uh, him when he pays. Ah, uh, okay, 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 okay. And that, and that's it. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay. Okay. Let's hear from Richard Mensa. <laughs> Richard Mensa, are you there? Okay, let's hear from uh, Azuzu. Azuzu. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm here. Richard Mensa is here. Okay, go ahead. Good morning to everyone. Good morning. Yeah, uh, my greetings to all people over here. Yeah, I was having problem yesterday. I was having problem yesterday with merchant registration. Three people, I registered three people and they were facing the same challenge. When you get to, uh, when you click on save or update, it tells you to load YouTube uh, video. I don't know whether yesterday some people experienced Yes, I experienced that but I wanted too. To know I, when I was on the field, I experienced that too. So I sent a message okay. to our member helper. So I'm sure they will, they will look into that, okay? Okay. I don't okay. know what I I wanted about. to know if it is a general yes, even problem. Me, even, yeah, even me, I face the same challenge. Yeah, yesterday. so I think they will resolve it. Mufa Moni, uh, are you there? Are you, or give us an update on that. Yeah, 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 I'm there. Yeah, I'm there. So I'm so sorry that I came a little bit late. Are you getting me? Yes, five five. Okay, uh, the issue uh, is being handled right now. So the IT has not responded on that because also uh, there was a slight hitch with uh, TBC 009, but it's already workable. But as soon as possible, it will be workable. So don't bother. It, they are working on it. And he was trying to make us to know that they are tying all the different elements together. So that is where the hitch came out. So they are still on maintenance. And as soon as possible, things will be working out well. 
they are working to make the website or the site to be more uh, uh, attractive, more presentable. It's just that a glitch went on. So you should not find it as a problem. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah, mobile money, uh, mobile money. Uh, Please, my uh, Spanish... if, if you want to speak, you, you should indicate. You don't just pop in because that will push others to be popping in, popping in, popping in. We Thank are you. billionaires Thank and we should speak like one. Okay, well noted, so well you noted. Can, you can go ahead now. Go ahead. Thank you. Uh, my son is having a, a problem with this facial recognition. When he tried to he snap the, uh, the snap, it will tell him an error. So he wasn't able to go to his, after paying his uh, 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 ad, admin fee. So that's a technical is there problem. Any way after this meeting, after this meeting, uh, just get the link of the technical problem. Move for money. Who we'll look that? Or we'll look into that. It will be solved. Yeah. Then uh, how do I get it? He'll be. He'll post the link on the on the Zoom. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Just just check the chat. The, the chat. The chat. You have it there. Then you can go to the meeting after this one. He will solve that issue. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. So um, let's listen to Lugrat Pam. Lugrat Pam, uh, can I hear from you? Unmute yourself. Are you there? You called me earlier. I'm, I'm there. Oh, that was Asusu. Go ahead, Asusu. Morning. Uh, good morning, everyone. In the house. Good morning. Um, I, I had an experience yesterday. I registered a uh, uh, merchant. So trying to fill uh, her uh, merchant form, the, listing, the merchant listing registration form, uh, by the time I submitted, it was written in red that uh, I have to submit a, a YouTube channel, whatever. Yeah, that's what we just talked about. That's what we just talked about here. We, uh, maybe you were not here when we were talking about this. Uh, it, it was a small glitch that is being worked on. So you just uh, be patient. And I think by today, end of today, everything will be fine. Okay. Um, look, look, wrap up. Are you here now? Can you go ahead? Okay. Um, Rita Kaba, are you on board? Good morning, Ambassador. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Yes, um, thank you very much for what you're doing for the community. I just want to, um, I have just yesterday registered my salon and we are accepting 20%. Mm, wow. So I just want to um, let um, all of us in the meeting, those of us in Croydon area, because my salon is in Thornton Heath. So if there, anybody lives in Taunton around Croydon and they are able to come to us, it's a Shekinah Glory Unisex Salon. And uh, if somebody wants the number, I can put our, our shop number in the Just chat it, as well put it on the chat. for people to come and spend their crinkles. Yeah. That's all I want to say. Wow. Beautiful. Excellent. Yeah, we, are, we are accepting 20%. <laughs> Congratulations, Rita. Thank Kemal. you. Bravo. Congratulations. <laughs> Put the contact there. Guys, go spend some Kringles. Stop asking where should I spend my Kringles. Go and spend. Yes, Ambassador. <clears throat> okay. Um, let's hear from Augustine. Augustine, are you here? Not mute. Yes, Augustine is here. Yes, sir. Go ahead. And um, greetings, the Derek and the house. And um the matter has already been um I mean, I want to talk please hold on somebody's already talking the matter has already been discussed upon you know yesterday um at this point i'm somewhere carrying out an official assignment but nonetheless i was still making efforts to bring in merchants and um yesterday while i was bringing in a merchant i still encountered the same challenge so I decided to try to check into it properly. And I, dis I thought, let me use that word. I thought that the glitch was deliberately set up by the administration to make it 
a little bit more harder for members in the community to get TBC. That's what I thought. So I decided to discuss with the merchant and tell the merchant that you may need to get a YouTube link. And um, I also started thinking that maybe the administration wanted merchants to be more willing to make some advertisements by themselves and then upload it on their page so that people can see proof that these merchants are really accepting Kringo coins. So I didn't know that it was actually a glitch, you know, but then since um, the technical team, which are in this place, has said it's a glitch, then I am hoping that once it's corrected, I'll go back to that merchant and then tell the person to ignore the YouTube um, link and then go ahead and submit. Because I thought or I was thinking that if this is going to be done as it is now, it will be more difficult for us to bring in merchants. But um, since they have all resolved it, then let me just calm down. Possibly by Monday, I'll check it out again. That's right. All right. Thank you very much, uh, Augustine, for that contribution. All right, um, Mr. Trust, start getting ready. Yeah, woman. Hello. Please. Uh, um, who is that? Is that um, uh, Maurice? Hello, Confidence. Confidence, okay, go ahead. Yeah, good morning. Um, I'm speaking from Ghana. Good morning. Yeah, I want to ask. Yeah, my my the person that the person that registered me told me that there will be an app, and I want to ask the the the, the use of the app and when is the app coming? The app will be coming next month, September. The app is going to help merchants to get uh, leads, notification for their business. So it's going to really help all business people in the community. Okay, please. And I want to ask that: Would, would they be uh, accepting hundred percent TBC or different currency too? No, you, the app has nothing to do with accepting hundred percent in TBC. We have. If you want to see those who are accepting some percentages in TBC, go to the merchant location on our website, and um, the app is just to help the business people to earn more money, and uh, if they decide to accept some percentages in TBC, that's fine. Because we are not yet at the economic phase of TBC. So now that we are still at the distribution phase, it is very difficult for merchants to accept 100% TBC. So if you even see a merchant accepting 100% TBC, you should even ask yourself some question before you, 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 you engage yourself. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Now, guys, let's Mr. Trust uh, walk us uh, with our um, app, the app we have in our wallets. Um, Mr. Trust will walk us in the wallet. Let's see how to use the, the um, application that we have in our wallet, which is so friendly. And that permits us to... Oops. Juliet, please make sure that you stay muted. All right, so we have an application in our wallet and some of us, we don't know how to use it, okay? Mr. Trust is a specialist in this wallet. He understand how to manipulate it around. So Mr. Trust, over to you. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Ambassador Mbe. Uh, can you please um, make my, my phone, uh, I'm using a laptop now and I wanna use Mr. my- Mr. Trust, more volume, please. Yes, yes, uh, okay, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Five, five on five. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Mr. Mbe, can you please uh, make my second number uh, host so I can use my phone? Because I I'm can't find your second phone. number. What's your name? What's the name? Please put okay. more volume. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that, that's me here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Speak 25%. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay, thank you. Uh, can you all hear me now? Very well. Okay, thank you so much, Mr. Ambassador Mbe. Okay, welcome everyone. Uh, 
for the purpose of the training of today, I will go through the wallet and like usual, uh, how many people in the chat, can you please uh, indicate if you have already uh, installed the TBC app wallet, just please say yes on the chat so we know how many people have the TBC wallet app. If you do not have, just say no. Just write it on the chat. Thank you. Indicate on the chat. Hello. Yes, hello. Can you can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Good morning. Hello? Yes, go ahead, please. Okay. Okay, I will share my I will share my screen right now. Okay, let me share my screen. The first thing I will do, I will I will assist you how to to download the TBC009 uh, wallet. Because there's a difference between the TBC009 wallet and the TBC app. Okay, here's the website. I will log into my my TBC. Zero zero nine app. Course, we are seeing your we are seeing your details. Why do you show your password? You don't need to show your password. Password. No, but yes. you guys, you guys, you don't have my password, guys. Not the password. Not the password. Thank Okay, just relax, relax everyone. Don't don't make noise, please. Okay. Now when you are in to when you are into your wallet, this is where you you need to download. Can you please just mute yourself? Please let's stay muted, please. Stay muted, please, please. Okay, as soon as you are into your wallet, the first thing you need to do, you need to download the TBC app. Okay, how to download the TBC app? Just come and you click on pay with app. If you check on the right of my screen, you will see pay with app, click pay with app. And then you can just click on Android, uh, download Android app. You click. And then when you click on download app, then you can download it here. And then what you're seeing here on my screen is the security key. And what you need to do, you just have to save this security key. You have to be private, okay? Yeah, share it. This is the security key. This is the security that you can just uh, scan later, okay? Then what you do, you open. After you have downloaded the, the GPC app, then you install. Wow. Okay. Okay. Mr. Trust on mute again. On mute. Stay muted, guys. Okay. Okay, after you have downloaded the app. What? Now, I'm back again. Can, can you please stay muted? Stay muted. Okay, just one, one, one minute. I'm just trying to set the... Uh, the key on the computer so I can just download the 
please more volume please can you hear me now yes okay just a minute i'm trying to set my computer okay then after after you have downloaded the application the tbc app you can see here on my phone i will show you the icon what it look like you can see here on the screen if you check is the cbc wallet okay can you all see it on the tbc wallet i can't see it i can't see it okay can you check the icon this the tbc wallet yeah okay i will pop it yes it's there it's there yeah, yeah. this is the one okay point, point then, the arrow now. Point the arrow. yes yes the arrow this is the one i'm moving okay yeah. this yeah. is the tbc app okay yeah, yeah. from yeah. your phone then you can click now click on that tbc uh, application app this is how it look like okay and now what you need to do you just need to scan your private key okay you click on scan to log in and then you, you scan the private key okay after you have scanned the private key the private key we automatically link to the tbc app okay now when you are into the tbc app you will see menu and then from the menu you will see a dashboard send receive and log out okay so now if you want to spend you want to spend your tbc you come you come and you click on send okay so after you have clicked on send you will see address and amount and currency now let's say um, you are you want to send or pay what you need to do you have this icon where you need to register the address wallet okay but usually the app is designed to not use the 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 address wallet is designed to use the scan okay because with the scan is more faster so what you do if you want to send kringles to any member you only need the member to send you his receiving wallet barcode okay okay so what you do you click on send come click on send scan sorry scan and then you can just scan the receiving barcode okay when you scan the receiving barcode you will see the receiving barcode we automatically link the address of the wallet okay yeah, yeah. thank you and then you just need to put the amount let's say what uh, and then before you put the amount you select the currency let's say i want to send to mr mbe yeah, yeah. cameroon i will just uh, click on kringles and i will select the the local currency where mr mbe is located so i will look for uh zav, france zav, 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 zav. i will look for france safer zav zav Z -E -F. Z -E -F. Mm -hmm. Z -E -F. okay Z -E -F. let me check on A x a f x a f yeah. yeah here's it okay then i will select and then i will say okay i want to send to mr mbe uh, based on his local currency i want to send him maybe uh one thousand kringles no what you now what you need to understand is that when you put the za now you don't you don't convert the currency 
you don't send the currency based on the Kringles. You now, because the wallet will automatically convert the Kringles so that you can send it based on the price of the local country. So I don't need to say uh, 1,000 Kringles. I will just say I want to send to Mr. B maybe 1,000 francs safer. So I will yeah. just write 1,000 francs safer, okay? So yeah. when I write 1,000 francs safer, you will see below, you will see the amount in Kringles, who is 0 0.12, uh, 1,2, 1,2, 1,6 Kringle. That is what word 1,000 francs safer. Franc safer. And then I will send. Okay. Then after I send, okay. yes. Now I will send. Then after I send, Mr. Mbe will receive the one thousand franc CFA from his wallet. And now let's say I'm going to a, a store, and I want to um, I want to uh, spend my Kringles. So what I want you guys to do is what I trained you last week. What you need to do, you have to come to your wallet and come on receive. This is what you need to train all the merchants. They have to do what? They have to come on receive, click on receive. And then when they click on receive, this is the display receiving barcode that they have from their wallet. Now, they need to set up the percentage that they are receiving through the receiving barcode wallet from the app, okay? So let's say I want Mr. Mbe to send me uh, 1,000 US dollars and I will set the price from the receiving barcode so that Mr. Mbe will not need to type the amount from his wallet. He will only scan the receiving barcode and the amount will appear from his wallet. It will only pay, okay? So what you need to do, you just come here, you click. Let's say Mr. Mbe is taking uh, a percentage, he's saying maybe it's 10%, and 10% is 1,000 US dollars. So I'll click here, I will select the currency as a merchant, and then I will display. When you click on the barcode, you will notice that, I want you guys to focus on the barcode. You will notice that each and every time I'm typing a number, the barcode will change. Okay? Each and every time I'm typing, typing a number, the barcode adjusts based on the price. Okay? So, I will type 1,000 US dollars. Who is the percentage that Mr. Mbe allowing into his store? So, now, what he need to do next is just need to screenshot like this okay and then display the barcode next to the product now you as a customer you only need to come to the store and screenshot and scan the barcode and pay just pay because when you scan the barcode i believe some of you you have already uh if you have the TBC uh, app right now, just scan this barcode. You will notice you will notice that the price, the one thousand US dollars, will appear into your wallet, and you can just pay. And if you pay, I will receive I will receive the one thousand US dollars in Kringles. <laughs> This is TBC. It's fantabulous. Yes, So this day, thank you so much, guys, for the motivation. So this is what go we go want. Go people, go. This is this is what we want people to understand that TBC is spendable and TBC have the technology to run his own economy. Okay, through the, the 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 wallet that we have, the blockchain that we are using, 
is the same blockchain that uh, in China. For some of you who don't know, in China, they are using the same system, okay? But the difference is that their technology are using another cryptocurrency, but our technology are using TBC coins, okay? So it's the same, the same one everywhere in the world. But the only difference is the coins, okay? So people don't have to say, stop saying, how am I going to spend Can you How many devices did you prepare? Okay, now, good question. What you need to do, remember, on the TBC, on the TBC, I will come back here. I will come back to the wallet. Okay, guys, just, just a minute. Just a minute. Let me go back to the wallet. Remember, do you guys remember the key, the, the, the key, the, your security key, okay? From the TBC009. Okay, let me go in back again. So you guys, you understand what I'm talking about because this is training. Let me log into my account. Okay, let me log into my account. And then, okay, now remember what I did. When you click on pay with app, there's this key. This is the key. I want all of you to, to print it out. Okay and save it very carefully. This key, you don't have to share this key with anyone, okay? You can print it out. Where is the key now? Which one is the key? This is the key. Press on, you see where it's written, pay with app? Okay. Yes. Click, click there, and then you see the second barcode. This is the key, okay? Okay. This okay. key. The, the, the back. Thank you. Is is written? Is written? Download, download app. Uh, Android app. This is the key. Security key. You don't share this key with people. This is your money. Okay. Because Sorry, we here to. The key. The, Come again. Which one do you say is the key now? Is it download app? Yes. You see, when you click, when you click on pay with app, it come, there's a barcode. You see this barcode below? Yes. This that black, the, the, this black, the black one. Here. Thank yes. you, the, the black the thing. Book. This is, thank you. Each and every one of you have his own barcode. This black, yes. what you call black thing. Yeah, this is a barcode, okay? You have to be QR, careful. QR code, QR code. Yeah, it's a QR code. Is okay. what you call the security? Yeah, it's a security key. Okay. You must have anybody. That's what he's trying to say. So, so you don't need to share this security barcode. Yeah. Tibetan, yeah. listen to me very careful. You don't don't share, don't yes, share this security oh, key. Yeah. Can you please mute yourself, please? Can you please? Yeah, please stay muted. Please stay please muted. Please mute yourself, please. Okay. I was trying to say what, guys, good people. Don't share this security key with anyone. That is where all your money is going to be stored. Okay. Some of people. Some people, and that is the reason, and that is the reason why Ambassador MB wants me to emphasize on this training because this is the key point of our economy. Because people will lose their coins just because of ignorance. So don't share this QR code key with anyone. 
There's a QR code key here, the one in front of you. This is the receiving barcode. There's a difference between the receiving QR code and the security key QR code. Okay? The security one is here on Pay With App. You click on Pay With App and then you print it. You have to print this QR code. Print it and save it. Okay? Or you can use two devices. Okay? How can you use two devices? You can have two devices and come here with the TBC app. Let me log out because it's already connect. I will log out. Thank you. Now, the good part is that, let me log out. Okay. And then after I log out, I will show you now from the app, I will click scan to log in. And then I want you guys to focus on the screen. You can see here, look what I'm doing. I want you to focus on something. I'm using my laptop now. I will remove, uh, let me remove pay with app. Now you can see here that here, this is the receiving barcode. I don't need to scan this receiving barcode because it's not the key, the security key. So the security is here. I click on pair with app. I click and then the security key will appear here. And then I have to scan the security key. Okay. When I scan it, it's going to link the wallet. Up. Is it clear now? Yes. Okay. Yes, yes, thank you. Okay. So you the have scan, two options. How do you scan? How, how, how yeah. is the scan about? The scan. How it's do you get one know, more uh, scan. scan? Listen. Okay. I, I will I will log out. I will log out. I will I will come back for the last time. Okay. I want you guys to focus. Look. After you have download, after you have download the TBC app. Here's the icon. I repeat again. Here's the icon on my phone. You can see here. Let me sort of look out. Here's the icon. This is the one I'm moving. I want you to focus on the icon. There's the TBC app. Then, after you have it on your phone, click on the on the TB, uh, on the wallet. And then this is what appear for the first time. You don't know anything. Okay. Then you have to link the TBC009 to the app. So now what we link the TBC009 to the app is the security barcode, uh, QR code key, okay? And that security QR code key, I will show you. Where is it? I will click here on scan. Now, for the purpose of the training, I want you to focus. Now I'm using two devices now. I'm using my laptop and I'm using my phone. The TBC app only works in your phone, okay? Not for your computer. You need to use a device, okay? So now, what I will do, you can see here, this is the wallet, okay? You can see here, I want you to focus on the mouse here. This is the receiving barcode. Now, if you scan this receiving barcode, it's not gonna link. I want you to guys to see. I'm trying to scan it. It's say error, val invalid. Do you see? Okay, so it's not the one. What you need to do, I want you to come here from your wallet, click on pair with, okay, pair with up. Okay, when you click on pair with up, here is the security key. Then when I scan that security key, it's going to link my wallet. Is it okay, uh, Mama, um, TVC Mama? Um, I'm, I'm on the phone doing it. <laughs> yeah. you, need to yeah, you need to practice. Show them how to send money. Uh, Show them how to send money That's again, because they need to know that as well. So okay. <laughs> Okay. With time, with time we will get in sending. Okay, let me sending let me. Okay, let me come back. 
because this is the purpose of the training. We want all the TVCN to master this because the moment we master this, we are going to enjoy our wallet, okay? I repeat, when you have the TVC wallet already, application in your wallet, you have download the application, where is it? The one in your wallet too, not on Google Play Store. The one Play in Store. your wallet. Some of not you go to Google. Google Play Store, the one in your wallet, the one in Google is a scam. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Ambassador. This is the Thank one. Thank you, Ambassador, for that precision. Thank you so much. Thank you. The, mm -hmm. the only way to download this icon is from your TBC 009 wallet. Here's Good. It. Yeah. Is it? Let me show you guys. I go back again to my wallet. Let me just click. Okay. Okay. Where's my wallet? Please. This is the only way you can download like this. Someone, 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 Okay, now I want to repeat myself. From the wallet, how to download the TBC app. This is how you download the TBC app. Not on Play Store, like Mr. May have said. Don't go to Google Play Store and download the app, no. Come to the TBC 009 wallet, log into your wallet, and then from your wallet, click on Pay With App. Here is it, on the right. You will see on the right, Pay With App. Click and then when you click, you see on top here, one is saying download app, an, an Android app. Can you see Android app? Yes, you can see. Click there, click on that Android app. Click. Then when you click, check. It's going to ask me to download, okay? Okay. Then you download. Then after you download, you wait for it to download. Now, after you finish to download, I'm using French, sorry about that. Then you open, you saying OOV is open. Open. And then when you open, you install. Saying install, then you install. Then it's going to install. Then you wait for it to install. After it Okay, after you install, say open, then you open the TBC wallet app. Okay, now, how do you know that the wallet is already uh, saved into your phone? Go to the dashboard of your phone, then you will see this icon. Here's the icon. I'm moving the icon. Okay, this is the icon of TBC the official TBC wallet app, here is it. I want your focus, this is the one. Now, what you need to do, click on that wallet, app, and then this is what is going to display in front of you. And then what you need to do, you need to scan the private key of your wallet. And the private key, where to find the private key, I will show you. Click on scan to log in from your wallet, from the TBC wallet scan. And then you need to use two devices, okay? Like right now, I'm using two devices to connect my TBC app to the TBC 009. Now, I'm, I open the TBC 009 in front of me. You can see from the camera. Yeah, I'm in my my wallet now, TBC009. So what I need to do, I need to come here and click. I need to come here and click on pair with app. Can you all see here? Yes. Then I click pair with app. 
And then when I click pair with up, you see there's a QR code who appear on top, okay? And then what I need to do, I need to scan this QR code. This is the key. Then when I click, I scan that QR code, it's going to link automatically my wallet. Can you see? Yes. Okay. Now, when I'm in my wallet now, I will go to the menu here on top. Then I will see display dashboard send and receive. If I want to send, I click on send. And then the wallet is designed, remember, the wallet is designed to use the scan, not the address of the, the wallet. So how do you operate using the app? We use the scan QR, okay? This is what we use the most. So what you need to do, if you want to send, you have the address, forget about the address, focus on with the amount and the currency. So if you want to send to any Tibetan, <coughs> ask the Tibetan to send you their receiving barcode, the one who is display, is who is display from the TBC 009 wallet when you open your account, okay? I will show you. This is the barcode from the TBC009. This is the barcode, the QR code, the one who's always displayed. This is your receiving barcode. It representing your address here below. You see this address here? This long, this long, this, uh, these letters, this, all these letters representing this barcode here. This is your receiving barcode. So you need to only to scan this receiving We will link the address. You can see here the address is here on the address. And then I will you display the amount. You select, you select if you are in Nigeria, Cameroon, whatever country you are, come to currency, select, and then select your local currency here. Okay. Then after you have select the currency, let me select. Uh, okay, let me see. Naira, Naira. Okay, let me look at Naira. NGN. 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 Okay, yes. from the wallet, you can't type anything. Remember, you need to select. Okay. NGN. Let me check for Naira. Okay, I'm seeing here Za. I'm from South Italian. Africa. Let me check it's Za. Up. Okay, Za is South African. Then I select mm -hmm. Za. I'm in South Africa right now. I select Za. And then I want to send to a member in South Africa 1,000 word of fingers. This is how it works. You can see I wrote 1,000 Za is rent okay for those who are in nigeria come here select naira let me select naira ngn here's naira uh. okay let's say i want to send 1000 naira can you see how much is how many kringles Word 1,000 Naira. Remove it, remove it, remove it. Okay, now, okay, now, after, after you have wrote the amount, then you can send, okay? Are you with me? Yes, please. Okay, then, after you have sent, this is how you can send Kringles to any member in your local community using the TBC app. Great. Okay. Now for the matching, for the matching is different. I want you guys to go each and every matching that you have brought into the community. This is what I want you to go and help them to set the price of the good that they are 
giving to us based on the percentage. They have to set the price of their product. And how they do that, they have to use the TBC wallet app. And how they do that, I'll show you. You come here now on this menu, then all merchant needs to come and use receive. Click on receive. Then we have a barcode who is just neutral. This barcode does not have any amount. Then what you do here on fingers, select currency. Now, from the currency, you can see here on the receiving bar, uh, barcode, they still have to add the currency of your local, uh, local uh, uh, country, okay? For now, we only have US dollars. But the admin is working on that. You want to put all the currency here. So it means let assume that uh, the, the currency in Nigeria is dollars, okay? We click the yeah. merchant, we, we click on US dollars here. He select US dollars. Let's assume Nigeria Naira. dollar. Nigeria dollar. Yes. He click hmm. select Naira. He select US and he select. Okay. Now after he select, the only thing you need to do is just to type the percentage. Let's say uh, the good is uh, one thousand US dollars in Naira, and then the merchant accepting. 10% of 1,000 US dollars. So it means 10% of 1,000 US dollars is $100. Yes. We all together, then we write, the merchant we write $100. So you see on the barcode, I want you to check. When I'm writing one, the barcode change. When I add zero, add zero, it change. I add it's another adjusting. zero, it's adjusting. Thank you. Then when he finished to adjust, this is the amount the merchant accepting for the product, the specific product. Then the merchant, what he need to do from his phone, he only need to screenshot this barcode and then print it out. Does it make sense? Yes. Thank you. A lot of sense, man. Thank All right. Thank so you now, very much. A, a, any one of you, if you just uh, screenshot, if you you scan this barcode, it will give you the hundred US dollars that you only need to pay. Same. That's all. Yes, and uh, no, we trust, can hear you. Uh, trust you must precise the the, the spending limits because people can just be okay. spending thinking that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. B. Let's say now. Um, those of those you, that are paying eight grains was their spending limit, for example. Okay, for those who are paying, let's say for those who okay, what I was trying to say, uh, Mr. Mbe, is that uh, the merchant have uh, is not all merchants are not considering about are not considering the 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 price uh, the they are not part of the the program yeah merchants can receive any amount is the sender thank now that needs to that has that issue thank you. So, so so now it's up to you what miss ambe saying trying to say is what it's up to you the the, the 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 member to pay your admin fee so you can have more uh more spending uh room yeah you you must have more room to spend your cookie because if, if you are not a the the changing limit is fifty dollars. So fifty fifty dollars it means that you are not going to be able to purchase maybe a good who is up to fifty dollars. Okay, so it's good to be uh, to pay your admin fee, your administration fee every month, so that you can spend have an unlimited uh, way of spending your coins. Okay, so this is what I think. This is what Miss Zambi want to tell. Oh, okay, so for the merchant, they only need to know how to set up their the price of their goods. So this is what I wanted you guys to understand how it works, so that it make uh, things happen fast. Because the more we focus on the merchant, 
the easy is going to be for the All right. Thank you. Can I come in? Yeah, let's, let's, come in, yeah? let's stop sharing. Uh, we have some okay. minutes left, so Thank you. we can now take some questions. Please, can I, okay. can I come here, please? Yeah, you can come in. Yes. Okay. Uh, uh, how you pick the address onto the, uh, the, this thing, the, the, the keyboard code? Please, can you repeat that, please, for me? How do you pick the address? Yeah. When, you, when you scan, the address you comes automatically. Uh, okay. It's when you scan. Yes. Once you scan, okay. you, you want the address scan. coming. Yes. When you, when you, once you scan, the address is being picked automatically. Yeah, it's going to link to, to your, 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 your wallet automatically. Because the barcode representing okay. the address. Okay. Yes. Thank you. All right, let's hear from uh, Dania. Uh, good morning to everyone. Morning. Welcome. Yeah, yeah I'm a new uh, member of TBC. I'm located within Ashiyama, Tema area. So I was introduced by my friend, a brother, that is Mr. John. So I'd like to know how can I become a merchant and then Moreover, uh, that you know, I'm late for joining the, the meeting. But I hope what I've heard now, I think it really makes sense. And then I wanted to know more uh, because when I have been registered already as uh, a member. So I like to uh, know how to become a, a merchant so that I can be able to also patronize within my community area here and then make sure I make more advertise to them and they're able to, uh, to patronize their, their goose. Okay, can you see my screen? Yeah, I'm seeing your screen very well. All right, now that you're already a member and you want to become a merchant, all you need to do is just go to your account area, you click on your account, and then you click on merchant listing registration. Merchant listing registration, and then you fill this form, name of your business, category, okay? Then uh, you, you fill this form, select the address, you make sure that the address must be on the Google map. The address you are putting here, your business address should be on the Google yeah. map. Okay, then um, you now have the town, the, the, the regions, and this one will come in automatically. Uh, if you want to, if you are, if you want to accept 10% in CBC, 20%, you can select, you can select the, the, the percentage here. Then you put the, the picture of your storefronts. If you have a YouTube channel, you can include that, and then you submit. Then uh, that's how your product will be listed on the merchant listing. The merchant listing is just here. People will, be, oh sorry, people will be able to see your products all over the world. Everybody in the community that put your city will be able to see your products because when you put, for yeah. example, let's just say my city where I am. Once you put it's that, right, right, right. then uh, you go to search. You go to search, and uh, I'm going to see. These are these are all merchants around the world that are already accepting some percentage. So if you list yours, mm -hmm. you have it listed also like this, like what you are seeing here. You see a lot of merchants. Yeah. So like this is how these are all people that are accepting some percentage, fifty percent. You know. Okay. Yeah. So that's how your product will be listed. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So what about if, my second, my second question is that, what about if maybe someone is not a merchant and then uh, is being sponsored by a fellow member who is within the uh, TBC uh, community already, who is a merchant and is sponsoring the, uh, the new member who has come in. So I ask, uh, will the new member that is coming in, will he also have a way forward to become, uh, maybe the, the member doesn't have any uh, goods to patronize? But right. he wanted to become a, a, a merchant. How does it also go about? Uh, if you don't have goods, maybe you, you can be, maybe let's say you are an engineer or a contractor or something. No problem. You can still come and fill the form. You can still come and okay. fill the form here. Still fill this form. Okay. There's no problem. Then you can put the, you can put your, the image of yourself. You can put, 
you are safe. People should see you. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank Wallex, you. let's hear from Wallex. All right. Good morning, uh, community. Mr. Imbe, thank you very much. And uh, Mr. Trust, thank you very much for taking us through our uh, TBC wallet. Okay, I just want to um, like add one or two things to what, uh, because I'm seeing a lot of opportunities, especially for the merchants, you know, in what uh, Mr. Trust have just shown us this morning. I'm seeing uh, a scenario whereby this will allow for merchants in the community, especially those who have different services and uh, products. You know, uh, a supermarket, for instance, if you enter a supermarket, they have different, I mean, countless products. So with this um, uh, TBC wallet app now, a merchant can actually set different QR code for different percentage of different products. Exactly. You know that you know that will help that will help that merchant for more sales because there are products you can accept fifty percent on, there are products you can actually accept seventy percent on, there are products you can accept ten percent, twenty percent as the case may be. So when you have those kind of options, you have the um, you 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 have more upper hand, you know, in making sales. And then when people begin to see QR code on your product, they begin to ask questions that what is this, you know, and that gives you an opportunity to also do your TBC business, you know. So I, I, I just want to, to, to say that just in case uh, it's only me that is seeing that opportunity in what was shown us this morning. So merchants should take advantage of that, you know, for uh, a lot of us don't, um, we're having challenges going out, meeting people one on one. But if you can place QR code on your on your services, I tell you, people will start asking questions. You won't have to start going out that much again. People just naturally come to you. Your QR code on your product becomes your advertisement because people will wonder what is this all about. Thank you very much for the time. You're welcome, uh, Walex. Uh, great contribution. Let's hear from John Dow. Sorry, sorry, Mr. Mbe. Sorry, please. Let me use this opportunity to tell okay. our Nigerian uh, uh, traditions. Sorry, please, especially those in Port Harcourt. Please, I uh, recently discovered that there's a lot of misconception about the, the idea behind TBC. And so uh, quite a lot of people have been calling upon me to step forward to start educating people, especially here in Nigeria. So we started a walk like three days ago. Uh, so I'm using this opportunity to uh, reach out to every Porter Court uh, based uh, Tibetians. Let's come together. We started already. Our next meeting is on the 4th of September at Randolph Hotel around Artillery Junction. So let's come together. Let's begin to educate ourselves. And you know, and the entire people, a lot. I mean, a lot of misconception. We need to set the record straight. We need to put things right. Good. We need to let people understand exactly what is TBC. You know, the A B C D of TBC. You know, so we we started the journey already, and it's going to you know uh, run like a wildfire to the entire state. You know. So uh, let's come and, and support the move. Thank you so much. Your contact number, please. Yes, my contact Maybe. number. Put it on the chat. Just uh, put okay. on the chat. I'll, I'll just put that on the chat. I will do that on the chat. Thank you. Yeah, OK. Yes, yes. Can I, can I can you? yes John. It's Mr. Charles. Good morning, Mr. Charles. Good morning. Is Mr. Charles. Yes, I'm around. I'm listening. Mr. Charles, is it, is it necessary for you to use uh, two device, devices when you want to. No, okay, okay, thank you. What what happens usually is that the moment you you scan the 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 security key for the first time, what is going to happen is going to link to your wallet forever, unless the network is poor. Okay. Okay. Yes. So when the net when the network is strong, it's going to automatically log in every time. But when okay. the, the network is poor, you still need to 
I scan the, the, the security key. And then what I usually, what I usually advise to people is that if you want to, if you don't want to face that, that, that problem, you need to just print out that key, uh, the security key and keep it maybe in your bag. So when the network is down, you just take out the, 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 the printing of the QR code, the, the security key, and then you scan it. That is how you okay. work. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, please, please, let me quickly add to that. Please, we need to start doing things like professionals. Those yeah. QR code can actually be on a plastic ID card form, you know? You yeah. can you can have it on a plastic card, you know, the same the same uh, uh, size with your ATM card. Yes. You can have that QR code on it and have it in your wallet, yes. you know, in your normal wallet you go out with. So you get into a merchant store, just bring out your plastic card, you, you scan your QR code and you make your payment. Fantastic. People around you will ask you questions. Right. And that's how you get people into the community. So guys, exactly. let's 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 make these things work, you know. Mr. Trust. Mr. Trust. Yes, sir. Hello. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, is is that, that that one you are saying that we should do secretly? I don't know what you see it. Yes, is the one. Okay. Yes. That we do. We don't have to. Uh, we don't. We don't have to uh, show it publicly. Thank you. You don't show it publicly. This is a private key. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right, John, uh, let's hear from John Asare. You have a question? Unmute. You have to unmute. We can't hear you. Yes, go ahead. Hello? Yes, speak it up. Yeah, please, this is, uh, my name is Alaji Sharif. I am speaking from Boko, Ghana, and uh, I am new here. I've been introduced to TBC by what uh, Alaji Sedu. Welcome. Yeah, and unfortunately, I joined the uh, the meeting late, and as we speak, Alaji Sedu promised to come with people that would take me through a registration process so that I can be a TVC member. But as it is now, uh, due to the COVID-19, I've even organized some people numbering to about 30. As, as up to now, we haven't had our meeting. And uh, actually, most of the things that were being discussed, I think I am strange to. Yeah, not strange as such. I have an idea, but there are not things that I actually practice. Yeah, that is what I, I, I want to say for now. So if you know that some of us are new, so that when you uh, explain certain things, maybe you should uh, be basic enough for us to get the concept. Thank you. That is what I want to say. Yeah. All right. Um, Alaji, <clears throat> you're in Ghana, right? You're in Ghana, right? So we have very, we have some yeah, great, I'm in Ghana. I'm in Ghana. We, we have some great leaders from Ghana, um, like Pastor Isaac, Michael, yeah. some of them are here. You can meet them and uh, they can explain the basics to you before okay. you can you, you, so that when you join this meeting you will not be completely lost. You understand? Because um, okay. we we cannot, you know, when you join a classroom where people are already in the, in the university and maybe you are still in primary one, you can be lost. Actually, actually. So you, you, you uh, need, you, you, we need to pump you up so that you grow up very fast and meet us in the university. You know, of course. That's why um, you can meet some great leaders here like uh, Pastor Isaac. Are you there? Who are those from Ghana? Please, educate yourself. Somebody need help here yeah, now. No, all right. So yeah, John, John do I'm here. You can just place your number. Yeah, you, can, you, you, can, you can just place yeah, your number. Yeah, we are here. Yeah, Pastor Isaac is here. Pastor Isaac is here. Pastor Isaac is here. Pastor Isaac is here. Okay. Pastor Isaac is here. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yes, so please, um, you can put your number on the chat so that um, Allergy can always get to you guys and, and uh, um, maybe need some help. 
Okay, don't send it to me personally. Send it on the on the group chat or to him and to him. Why? Yeah, I think I will appreciate that. I will appreciate that very much if they do that. Yeah. Yes, from there they will take you through. They will take you through. Yeah. Okay. All right. <clears throat> All right. So, Mister, uh, please, so a follow up to MD's uh, explanation. There is, you know, when you get to a merchant shop, MD yeah. said you can put a QR code. To different items. For instance, you want to buy radio, put the arrow code there. You want to buy the <laughs> My question now is that, you know, in a merchant shop, all these items you pick them to where you are going to pay. At which point now are you going to scan your QR code? Is it where you want to pay or in the various departments that the QR code is placed? Various department, you know the price and then. Uh, Various, 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 um, the various code, you scan into the various code. That's you, you scan before you carry those items to where you pay? At the point of payment. It's at the point of payment. When it is time to pay, just like when you get to a supermarket, they gather all your, all your products on their table. And now it is time to pay. They will start punching the numbers in their calculator. So once you have all your product and it is time to pay, that's the time to start scanning the QR code to make payment. Who scans the QR code? You, you. or the you. you? You. You. You have your own private key. You have your private key with you in your wallet somewhere. Maybe you print it on a piece of paper or like I suggested on a plastic card to make it fanciful for people to ask questions. And then you scan that key, that that uh, the security key barcode, and then it will link your wallet with the app. You understand? Then you you will be ready to make payments. So you see another scan to make payment also on your on your phone. Then that's when you scan the QR code of the merchant. Okay. okay. Thank you, guys. Uh, we are already uh, out of time. Uh, we are very very sorry. We are out of time. No, Can I no, come in again? No, 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 no. We, we, we must respect our time. Nobody comes in again. We are very sorry. We are very, very sorry. Uh, we have a meeting after this meeting for technical issues. If you have technical issues, those um, who are technical, you have some technical problems, there's a link that has been posted on the chat. Please follow that link. Uh, there's a meeting just after this. Just after this. All right. There's a meeting just after this meeting. So. Uh, follow the meeting and let all your technical problems be solved, okay? We are already out of time, so we are very, very sorry. Guys, this meeting is taking place from Monday to Friday. Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. West Africa time. So if you're new, you're welcome. We appreciate you. We welcome all new people here. You guys are all welcome. Make sure you join us every day when it is 8 a.m. West African time. The key word of the day is Kringle. Kringle is the key word of the day. So insert the key word and you get paid. You get paid for attending this meeting, okay? All right, guys, it is weekend. It's Friday. Enjoy your weekend. We love you so much. And uh, let's do this again on Monday. Same time. Same time. Bye now. All right. Bye now. Bye. Bye. Enjoy your weekend. You. Enjoy your weekend. Thank you. Enjoy your weekend. 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 Enjoy